a lot of people come to me and say, you know, I've massively improved my lifestyle and I'm still not pregnant. To which I say, well, that's because lifestyle and diet are not treatment. They are important and essential foundations upon which to overlay effective treatment. But let me give you an example. If you had a tooth pain and you go to, a, to your dentist and your dentist simply says to you, you know what, let's just get you brushing and flossing your teeth you will be a bit confused because you have a tooth pain, but that's the treatment that they've given you. And on the other side of that coin, if you go to another dentist who's a bit more gun ho so to speak, and they basically say to you, you know what, let's just put a cap on it and, you know, that should resolve your problem. It's even more strange because we still haven't fixed or understood the reason as to why the tooth pain is there to begin with. Of course, you to have healthy teeth, you still need to floss and brush your teeth. And it may be the case that you might need a cap on your teeth, but on your tooth, but you don't know. Like, why, why is the pain there? Is it because of nerve damage? Is it because of an infection? Is it because of some other, you know, more sinister situation? Unless we understand the root cause of the problem, we can't really fix it effectively. And that's one of the things that I teach my patients when, we, when it comes to overcoming infertility and recurrent miscarriage, especially when other treatments have failed. It's not enough to just put a cap on it or floss and brush your teeth. So have a conversation with our team to figure out what's actually getting in the way for you. Hope that helps.